Hi Capricorn, it's Lynn from Tinker Tarot. I'm here to do your September 2020 Cartomancy reading. Cartomancy is the art of reading the regular playing cards. I'm also going to take a card from the Animal Spirit, the Wild Unknown Animal Spirit deck by Kim Kranz. Very wonderful cards and um but they're very different from the tarot so i'm still learning them and i will have to use the book i hope you don't mind um this video this month's video is brought to you by virgo and libra thanks to their contributions um this is an ad free video for you this month so Let's get your vibes in there, Capricorn. Hmm. Capricorn. Hmm. Capricorn. What are the messages for Capricorn September 15th and on? What do they need to know this month? I, they're getting pretty ready. I can feel it. Yeah, they're ready. So what I do is I lay out seven piles and I go around three times so that there's three cards in each pile. I lay them face down and right side up and I turn over the piles as I get to them. Okay, so Capricorn, what do we have for you? What do we have? Okay, huh. We have the Six of Spades, the Queen of Spades, and the Five of Spades. Um, it looks like there was some sort of bad move made. There's a regret. You feel like you're going in the wrong direction. Um, also, could be this person is going in the wrong direction. This is a very dark-eyed person. Dark brown or black eyes. Um, this person is also known as the um, single not by choice. She's the scorned woman or man. Um, widowed, divorced, separated, something like that. Um, this could be a bad move on her part um, and feel... She, she she may feel like she can't recoup her losses, okay? This could be you, Capricorn, or someone around you. Um, yeah, so they've made a bad move, or you've made a bad move. Um, it's causing you trouble now, okay? What's coming in? Um, hmm, Wow. Uh, five of hearts, eight of diamonds, and the queen of diamonds. Now, the queen of diamonds is known as the older woman. She usually has gray, white, platinum hair. Green eyes are very light blue eyes, maybe gray even. Um, but she's older, she's mature, she's experienced. She has a lot of connections and all different things. Um... This could be your mother, even, Capricorn. It could be your mother or a mother maternal figure in your life. It seems to me like they're giving you support um, in something that you're going through. You know, it, it, there's a five there and a five here, queen here, queen there. So this is where you're getting loving, support, affection, um, something that's going to mean a lot to you. You're never going to forget this, um, this person being on your side, you know? Um, yeah. So above you, this is on your mind. You have the two of clubs, the king of diamonds and the eight of spades. Jeez, you sure have a lot of people in your life, Capricorn. Um, this also could be you or someone around you. King of Diamonds is the same deal as the Queen of Diamonds. Green, gray, or maybe even, um, really light blue. 
um, eyes. It's usually known as the older person, the mature. They have experience. They've seen things come and go, you know. And um, could be a lawyer. Uh, or a banker, you know, someone that helps you with your finances. Um, someone with a keen mind. Like I said, this could be you. You're thinking about having a meeting this, with this person anyway. And it could be regarding slander, some sort of slander uh, against you. Like what's going on down here? So you could be thinking about, um, because it feels like it's, it's confrontational, you know, it, it could be in this meeting, you could be confronting, having to confront someone that, and it wasn't your intentions when you went to the meeting, but you may have to tell them what's, what's what, okay, you might have to set them straight. And none of us likes to, you know, do have to do that, but sometimes it's required. Um, oh, geez, every single pile you have people, okay? And like I said, you could be any one of these people. Here is the king of clubs. Now, the king of clubs is a brown or hazel-eyed man could be a woman too um they they have they're like an idea factory they have really good ideas um and good luck they seem to manage to get them themselves out, out of anything pretty much okay um this could be you capricorn it seems like there's uh the work that you're doing where you're doing it is coming to an end you could simply be changing jobs. You don't want to do that or that career any anymore. It could be difficult or something like that for you. Um, or you could just be working for a different company. You also could be retiring, you know, because the Ten of Clubs is, is retiring at some time, sometimes. Also, there's a chance you could be moving closer to work, right? So this is your influences, your exterior influences, how other people are seeing you or influencing you. And you have the uh, Six of Clubs, the Five of Diamonds, and the Jack of Diamonds. Hmm. Well, it seems that you're working hard. You have a lot of mouths to feed. You know, you are not just taking care of yourself. You're taking care of others too, um, or they rely on you. There's lots of people that rely on you and your income. Um, they could uh, be pr trying to take steps Um, you might get a letter or something saying something about a portion of your money goes to them. Something like that. Okay. Not positive. Or you might have to, have to help support a youngster, like a teenager or something like that. In the foundation, this is where it all started. You have, you have the four of diamonds, the two of hearts, and the ten of hearts. Um, yeah, another ten. I think you might be moving. I think you're moving closer to work, so you're you're you don't have to travel as much back and forth to work. That's what I'm wondering here. Um, yeah, you're undecided whether to, you're trying to make a decision. Should you make a move? Should you not make a move? Um, you, I think you may have a meeting with the family about it. Um, you could even be moving in with family. Um, but 
it, it, it's it's something that's going to give you joy to have again that support that you know um people on your side right and you find out that very thing in this meeting in this you know chat it's a very friendly chat get together could be some sort of family reunion or something like that or party family party maybe perhaps um and then Let's upside down the other way, right? Right. Okay. So, Seven of Clubs, the Ace of Clubs, and the Eight of Hearts. This is the surprise. And I do think you're moving. I think you're worried about moving. Like, once you find out that you are, um, I think you could get a lot of housewarming gifts, a lot of support, people talking, encouraging you in this endeavor. Um, I think it's quite surprising to you because it's not the fact that you were moving. I think it's where you're moving to or, you know, yeah, it's where you're moving to, I think is the, the surprise Capricorn, but it's all good. You're very happy about it. You like, I think it's moving closer to home, closer to family. It says up here closer to work, and that may be the case as well. You know, your work might be closer to your family, but it says you're bridging that gap, I think, okay? So, let's get your wild, unknown animal spirit, Capricorn. Let's see what we got here. Oh, look at that right there. The otter. The otter. Now, I think uh, the otter is water energy, but uh, just double check that. Uh, yes, it is. There it is. Very pretty blues, eh? Blues and yellows. Um, unobstructed joy playfulness contentment perhaps the most joyful creature within the animal spirit deck the otter represents absolute bliss otter energy is the playfulness of a child available to us at any age they have a giddiness and a reverence for life itself without the presence of doubt worry or skepticism imagine yourself with a little more otter energy what would life look like? What would it take to bring you there? The otter, otter card begs these questions and wants to transport us to this precious place as soon as possible. The celebration awaits. So to bring it to the, back into balance, uh, attend a dance party or a celebration. So, yeah, I think that that's the thing. You long to be closer to home, closer to that affection and support and all of those really good feelings, you know, all of that. I think you thrive when you're in that energy, as do we all, right? So, anyway, you'll have to let me know, Capricorn. Um, if you like this video, hit that like button, share, and subscribe. It's all free and it helps me a lot. I really appreciate it. And comment too in the comments below. I read every single comment and I really appreciate you letting me know if it, you know, jibes with you or not. Um, and lastly, um, if you're a Virgo or Libra cr cross watcher, it's your time to contribute to the ad-free videos. So thank you very much and have a great day. Bye now.